Let's read this real quick. Okay. Right? This is a um in a biblical historian and identifying uh the image of Christ. And the reason why I, I want to break this down is because I think there should be a, a class lawsuit against the Roman Catholic Church by this uh, uh, lying on history, on, on the depiction mm -hmm. of Jesus Christ. And this whole lie that we don't have any record of how Jesus Christ looked like. Okay, let's read this real quick. Brother, if you don't mind. Okay. In 1931, an Austrian Jewish biblical scholar, Robert Eisler, published and translated the recently discovered Josephus work titled Capture of Jerusalem. Now you notice, know right? You got the war with Jews. Uh, you got the different works, but you, you don't, you barely hear about this work. Mm -hmm. So this is a much larger work of what you hear, what you, you know, you usually see uh, within um, Josephus work. Let's see what Josephus says about the depiction of Christ. Yes, sir. Okay. And it reads, at that time also, there appeared a certain man of magic power, if it be meet to call him a man, uh -huh. whose name is Jesus, uh -huh. whom certain Greeks call a son of a God. Uh -huh. But his disciples call the true prophet, who is supposed to have raised dead persons and to have cured all diseases. Both his nature and his form were human, human? for he was a man of simple appearance. Mature age, black skinned. Read that relaxed. again. Read that again. Black skinned. Read that again. Black skinned. This is the reason why they don't want Egyptians to be black because Israelites always were mistaken for Egyptians. Mm -hmm. Black skin. Come on. Short growth, uh -huh. three cubits tall, hunchbacked, Honactus, lit literally with a long face. Macro prosopos, a long nose, eyebrows meeting above the nose that the spectators could take fright with scanty curly hair, but having a line in the middle of the head after the fashion of the Nazarenes with an undeveloped beard. Because the undeveloped means he has spots in his beard, right? So this goes back to the scriptures, right? It says there will mm -hmm. be that his, his, his appearance would not be something to look at. Right, that his appearance would not be something to, to gaze on because he was not considered a good-looking man. Mm -hmm. Right. Let's read this part. Says this First no, century. We don't know how the Israelites used to look like. Right. Mm -hmm. Let's read. Okay. First century Judea. Judea had been a Roman province since six A.D. Tacitus wrote in the Annals of Imperial Rome. Many, again say that the Jews were a race of Ethiopian of what? origin. Of what? Of, of Ethiopian origin. No, they were mulatto. They were uh, mm. Arabic. They were, you know, they were um, Middle Eastern. Mm. Read that again, if you don't mind. Okay. Tacitus wrote in the annals of Imperial Rome, many, again, say that they, Jews, were a race of Ethiopian origin. The great revolt of Jews still living in Judea led to the first Jewish Roman war starting in 66 AD. Exactly, right? Come on. Mm -hmm. In 70 AD, Titus, a Roman general, surrounded Jerusalem, forbidding any entry or exit. This led to famine and ultimately the destruction of the Second Temple. And the Jews who had remained were slaughtered. Josephus, an historian during that time period, estimated that 1.1 million Jews died and another 97,000 were sold into slavery. Uh-huh, come on. Now, let's go to the next slide real quick. There's just a few slides, not, 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 not many. What is, this, what is the, the historical understanding of how the Egyptians look like, right? We all know that the Zandabal Bible Dictionary, right? Mm -hmm. Ham, the youngest son of Noah, born probably 96 years before the flood, and one of the eight persons who lived through the flood, he became the progenitor of the dark races, not the Negroes, not us, right? Why? Because we look like Hamites. And he says, not the Negroes, but the Egyptians. Why? Because the Egyptians look Negro. They don't look Arabic. Ethiopians, Libyan, and Canaanites, right? Mm-hmm. 
Now, this is the guy who came on the show. This this Middle Eastern imposter Egyptian. You're not a real Egyptian. You're an imposter. And I saw this. Uh, now you notice it. Now they're displaying, you know, image of Jesus Christ, looking a little more Middle Eastern. His hair is a little messed up, and you know they're trying to make him look like like miss someone in the middle. They're all mm-hmm. in on it. It's, they're all in on it, right? They're all in on it, right? And I, I um, so don't let them fool you with that whole. Well, I, he was olive. You know, he was he was you know his, he probably had a dark game because he was on the sun a lot. Yada yada yada. Don't let them fool you. Don't let them fool you, folks. That's how they get you. I will send fire to this land. 